Today I'm going on a real life treasure hunt. Well, not really a treasure hunt, but more like a scavenger hunt. At the end, we're looking for some that people have hit around the city. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about geocaching. Geocaching is basically where people hide treasures around the city and they put a description on where to find it. They give you clues and you have to go look for it. So once you find a geocache or the treasure, it comes with a log. And on that log, you put the date and the time when you found the geocache. So for the first geocache is in this parking lot right behind me. The name of the catch is it sure gets loud here. The difficulty level is a 1.5. So as you start to go up more, the more it starts to be challenging. And for the description, it says been at this parking lot many times before, and I'm always amazed by how loud it gets there. Can you hear it? This should be an easy parking grab. You're looking for a small container that only holds a log. Need to bring your own pen to sign the log. The person who hid the catch says it's a parking grab. So let's go look for this shit right now. So we found the catch supposedly. It says it's a small container. The catch should be right around here. Shows it on the map. It says it's right below the pole. We're looking through all the bushes, see if... He said there's a small container? Is it under that shit right there? Oh, it is? Let me see. Oh, shit, it's right there. All right, perfect. <laughs> oh, that's what's up. That's dope. Shout out now, boys. Here's the log. I don't want to take anything. 9, 25, 24, cash. For sure, the first catch, it wasn't that bad, bro. Get that shit out of my face. No, I'm <laughs> All right, for the next catch, it's called Lucky 13. And the description says, I'm replacing my catch, quote unquote, tennis anyone. I decided to place another catch close by. It gave me something to do while I was waiting for the area around, quote unquote, tennis anyone to be available again. This is my 13th catch, thus the name. The container is a blinker, so search accordingly. I'm sorry the hint was confusing. Think about the description above before reading the hint. So we're about to go and see if we can find this catch. It should be right in there, so we're going to look right now and see what's up. So we found one catch before, and we're gonna find another one right now, watch. Hopefully we don't run into any fucking homeless, dude. Oh shit. All right, so it says, what should it be? Or do you, it smell like pee pee. It does smell like piss. It does look like homeless have been back here. Damn, where could it be, dude? Maybe it's on the other side? No way it's through there, fool. No way it's over there. Highly doubt is over there. <laughs> I'm not going in there to check. We're gonna call this a fell right here. And yeah, in the video, we're gonna show our fells. It is what it is. We're gonna move on to the next catch. So for this next catch, it's called I Wish I Was At Home. So we're gonna check this out, see what the description is. This is a difficulty 1.5. So again, the higher you go, the harder it is to find these catches. The last catch I failed, I completely failed on that one. So hopefully this one will find one. I hope this catch finds a long-term home here. There was another one in this parking lot. For that, it went missing. So be stealthy so muggles don't remove this catch. This should be an easy parks and grab looking for a small container that only holds a log. Need to bring your own pen to sign log. So I guess with this next catch it should be around this area right here so let's go check it out and see what was good hopefully the person don't think that we're breaking into his car no oh no there's nothing in there Feel like a bolt oh right here right here look I found the catch bro 25 24 we'll put cash so it's the next day I ran out of daylight yesterday and for this catch it's called runaway for geo dog it's at this random park I found driving around it's at a difficulty two so it's higher than the previous ones that were 1.5 I look for nice parks for geo dog to play ball this was one that was close to home I found this small neighborhood park while geo catching there used to be a great catch nearby geo dog likes the long run enjoy no the park closes half an hour after sunset if you happen to linger the sprinklers come on at 9 44 p.m so according to the map it should be somewhere down there there. So from what it shows on the map, it should be directly over there. Is it this? Nope. Wait. Nope. I think I just pulled that shit right out of the ground. I feel like this should be under these rocks right here. Even though this geocache is a level two, I found myself in a bit of a situation. 
Bro, where could it be? After about an hour of searching in the sun, I thought I would see the geocatch up in the trees. Maybe I just missed it. But when I was about to give up, I found the geocatch, but it has been tampered with and f***ed up. It's empty, dude. Dude, no wonder I couldn't find it. It's literally on the ground and the cap is right over there.